the seven steps to prep. The purpose of this video is to go over the seven steps to prep for your upcoming surgery with Dr. Hallaby or Dr. Farkas. If you are watching this video, you are provided with a bag of supplies and a UC Davis folder during your recent clinic visit. I will be referencing both the supplies in your bag and in the folder during the course of this video, so please have them available and have something to write with in case you want to take notes. Step 1. The Ensure Immunonutrition Shake. In your bag of supplies, you will find a total of 15 cartons of Ensure. Research has shown that drinking three shakes a day for five days before and or after your surgery will help your body recover from surgery. One of the unique ingredients in this Ensure formulation is the amino acid arginine. Arginine is essential for wound healing and infection prevention. And because the body's stores get depleted during surgery, this Ensure shake will help replenish your stores. Start drinking three drinks a day, starting six days before surgery. You will stop the drinks one day before surgery. The feedback from our patients is that the drinks taste better cold and are on the sweet side. Step two, Hibiclens soap. In your bag of supplies, you should see Hibiclens soap. Two days before your surgery, please start showering once a day, doesn't matter if it's in the morning or evening, using this antibacterial soap. Please avoid your groin or bottom area as the soap tends to dry out mucous membranes. The purpose of the shower is to minimize the bacteria that live on the skin to minimize the risk of post-operative wound infections. Step three, a clear liquid diet. In order to start clearing out your gastrointestinal tract of waste material, we ask that all patients follow a clear liquid diet the day before surgery. You may have a small breakfast, such as a hard boiled egg, toast, yogurt, or Ensure drink, and then clear liquids the rest of the day. Please refer to your shopping list that was included in your pre-op folder. At the bottom of the shopping list, you will see examples of clear liquids that you can purchase. Please make sure you stay hydrated and drink plenty of water. Step four, bowel preparation. In order to more thoroughly clean out your GI tract, you will need to mix a 238 gram or 8.3 ounce bottle of Miralax with 64 ounces of Gatorade. Any flavor will work. Though it may seem to be a lot, the Miralax will be diluted into the Gatorade and you will drink it one eight ounce cup at a time until it's gone. We recommend drinking a cup every 15 minutes, but if you start to experience cramping, nausea, or bloating, it is okay to wait 30 minutes between cups. As a note, walking helps with bloating and gas. Step five, prescribed pre-op antibiotics. Your surgeon has prescribed neomycin and flagyl to be taken the day before surgery to help reduce your risk of infection after surgery. The medications should have been called into your preferred pharmacy. The time that you will take both medications will depend based on the time of your surgery. If your surgery starts at 7.30 a.m., you will take the medications at 1 p.m., 2 p.m., and 11 p.m. on the day before surgery. If your surgery starts at a later time, someone from the colorectal clinic will call you with the adjusted times for your antibiotics. Step six, Ensure pre-surgery. You will note a bottle of Ensure pre-surgery in the bag of supplies provided to you. This is a rehydration drink that helps to reduce dehydration and nausea when you wake up from surgery. It is to be consumed four hours before your surgery time. For example, if your surgery is at 7.30 a.m., you will need to drink the Ensure pre-surgery at 3.30 a.m. This should be the last thing that you drink, and afterwards you will need to have nothing to eat or drink. Step seven, incentive spirometer. The incentive spirometer is a plastic tool with a blue mouthpiece. If we included this in your bag of supplies, we want you to start practicing before surgery. The purpose of using this breathing tool is to expand your lungs and minimize your risk of breathing complications during and after surgery. Besides these seven steps, here are some general notes to keep in mind. Our staff will call you with your surgery date and then you can count back six days from that date to determine when to start your Ensure Immunonutrition. The OR staff will be in touch 24 to 48 hours before your surgery to tell you the time of your procedure. You will find a map to the OR in your packet of information and a phone number to call if you have not heard from the OR staff about your procedure time 24 hours before. After watching this video, if you have questions about preparing for your surgery, please call the Cypress Clinic and ask to speak with the colorectal nurse navigator. The telephone number is 916-734-7000.
2680.